man. I'm getting lost. Uh, what does the kid want to do? Oh, she hasn't drawn up there for a while. It's pretty chilly. We're getting there. It's close. I'm feeling it. I mean, luckily we have Roman to to be able to guard. But man, if he wakes up, then I'm gonna have him go uh play guitar until the end of the day. Have him talk to the kid. I honestly don't know what to do right now. She hasn't played jump rope for a while. You can go play in the snow. I don't know if she knows how to play guitar. I don't think she does. Oh, nice. He's awake. Okay, actually, go up there. I don't know if she's tired, too. How do I make them... Somebody did... Coffee drinker. How do you drink coffee? This more of mine drink coffee. Uh, survivors with the coffee would drink coffee daily, so as long as it's available in the inventory, we use one coffee and one clean water per day automatically. If its items are in the inventory, drinking coffee can prevent or alleviate sadness or depression. Okay, I see. Amelia, coffee shortages can be, okay, gotcha, gotcha. And he plays guitar, so that helps him. Oh. Go, go put one in, quick. Or, Iskra. Okay, good. See if we can get her to put that in there too. Just one more. The night. Oh boy. Oh boy. What do we do? Guard. Guard, sleep. Nah, sleep with child. Day 28. That was a good night. Was angry and argued with us, but it wasn't easy to call her down. She's feeling much better. We just need to keep an eye on her. All right, good. Uh, how this for mine cigarettes. Okay. Cigarettes or alcohol can become black. Okay. Uh.
some characters are smokers and they will consume these items to satisfy their addiction. Smokers will consume a set number of cigarettes per day and will also be used for... Okay, gotcha. So it sounds like they you just need them in your... Um, to be able to have them. The soldiers came and told to get us out. They gave everyone a minute or two to evacuate, then they threw in grenades. People they suspect of helping the rebels were shot on sight. They didn't. They let us go because Iskra had no one else but me. Damn. Officials of neighboring announced that they would undertake the task of protecting people from prosecution and the civil war within a week. <gasps> He was shot by a sniper and is on his way to work. He will be missed. Oh, wait, who? Oh, you listen to it. We regret to announce that a colleague, Julian, died this morning. Temperatures are still very low. Alright, he's very hungry. Let's see if we can, uh... Might be able to boil that water too. Uh, we need fuel. Or one filter. Make. Okay, so she's hungry, he's hungry. What about the kid? The kid's depressed. All right, we gotta go scavenge tonight. We gotta get fuel or something. Someone's at the door. I don't like it when the dogs argue. <laughs> Me too. Me too. All right, let's have Roman sleep. Oh wait, she's very hungry. Hold on, my guy. Alright, let's have one of these. Let's put the thing in here. Yeah, she, she does need to rest. We'll bring food to her, I guess. Oh, she doesn't know how to use that. All right, you go eat something. All right, let's go chat with the guy at the door now. <laughs> That's funny. Only one of them can go at a time. Alright. So, um, how about some food for some coffee? Okay, maybe not. How about for some parts? Okay. Weapons parts. Bandages. Hey man, can I get one for you? Oh no, it's gonna cost a lot. All right, fine. Uh, 
Uh, how about some coffee too? Good deal. Alright, you go lay down. The kid is the, the hardest part now. Let's boil some water. Need one filter. Actually, wait. We can have Roman go talk to the kid. We gotta uh, go back to the other place now. Tonight we're having Cristo go. Alright, let's make some clean water. We're so close. Actually, almost there. Dad. Oh, man. Daddy. Uh oh, we need to put a fire in the thing. can't talk to each other maybe there's something better to do I don't want to play alone jump rope Let's end the day. Oh man. Wounded, sad, guard, sleep, and we gotta go get some stuff. So we're gonna go to the semi attached house again. And I think we're good with not bringing anything. Pretty sure. Yeah. There's a good amount of components here and some wood. Uh, last time we left. So we should be able to pick some of that up. down here nice and 
Nice. Woo. <laughs> I don't know if there's anything else we can grab. I'll just check this. Ooh. Let's run to the exit. You better run to the left, not to the right. Alright, good. I can't believe that the one time you tried <laughs> running through there instead of going to the left. And we almost started combat too. Oh, that would have been the worst. Literally, it could not get any worse than that. Loading. The cold days have passed. <gasps> night I had a really good haul. The night was calm. Chris had been searching for surprise. Oh man. Yes. She's still recovering. All right, talk to the kid. Wait, who else can talk to the kid? Let's have Roman's just tired. Let's have him go rest. If I die, I don't want to die. <laughs> so sad. Alright, I guess I'll have him rest. She wants to do something. Like what? Can you, can you go outside? Can you play on the swing outside? Or how about go, like, check out this place? There's a ton of toys in here. No? Okay. Oh, crap. Actually, I need to go talk to the kid. Yeah, kid. <laughs> Why are they not facing each other? There you go. Oh my gosh. Do you want to hear a story? Dot dot dot. What just happened? What's wrong, dear? Hey, were you crying? Why do they keep stop talking to each other? Roman, go play the guitar. Let's go have him rest. Actually, kid, go throw one in the in the fire.
Roman's pretty good at that. Wait, the kid hasn't drawn up here for a while. Maybe that'll help. I don't want to play alone. Ah. Ugh. I don't know what else she would want to do. I wish you could go downstairs and push the kid on the swing. Oh, we can make one of these? Listen to the radio. We're happy to announce it's getting warmer. Temperatures continue to rise in the upcoming days. We're listening to. We regret to announce that Carl Lake Jovian died. to Radio 1. There's nothing. Alright, it's end the day. Uh, let's sleep in bed with the child. Hungry. Yeah, we'll do that. Day 30. Oh man, we've been raided. <laughs> Thankfully, we were able to fend them off. Oh, man. Thankfully. <laughs> Go rest. Alright, go talk to the kid. Oh, no, she's broken. We gotta figure out how to make her happy. Is he very hungry? Okay, he's very hungry. What is he... I need to look up how to keep the kids happy. This war of mine happy kid. Uh, children always seek for mood boosters when idle children will go play around the shelter looking for that. Um, one meal every three days. Need less food than adults. At first they don't have any skills to do things. At night, children cannot scavenge or guard. They are unable to guard the shelter. It's po it's possible for children to get a karma or bad ending if they have gotten injured too much. Even though players have done nothing criminal, the exact time is unknown. Muscra automatically pairs her with her father, Cristo. She is somewhat liable but can be fought, taught to do various things. For example, cooking, cigarette filters... Um, objection speech, roll, gets sad often, gets depressed if not adequate, protected during range. She often asks her father questions about the war if he wants to play games or riddles. She engages in child play with toys, but or engaging in activities such as drawing on the wall. Um, yeah, we need to talk to her, man. He's broken right now. Father Chris, 
Crusoe can reliably talk her out of depression, after which can alleviate her sadness by playing. Her mood can also improve simply by getting a good night's rest. Use the project during the day, your father. Okay. Let's try everything we have. If she doesn't want to do that, right? How about this one? No, maybe there's something better to do. the kids some raw food oh man okay so she doesn't want that what does she say when she wants to do this Where is he going? Oh, he's going to sit down. <laughs> Alright, let's see if she wants to do this. We tried that one. Can we go on the swing outside? Jeez, dude, she doesn't want to do anything. Ah. I listen to the radio. The Russian promised their forces were going to put an end to the conflict in a matter of days. Okay, we're happy to announce it's getting warmer. Uh. Yes, right. This war of mine. How do we... She engages in child's play. Okay, we see that. She often answers her father questions. Uh... I just don't understand. Who will talk to the kid? Oh wait, she's very hungry, I forgot. Will he go talk to the kid? Alright, go lay down. Daddy! <laughs> Daddy! 
Here we go. See if he'll talk to her. <sighs> ah, come on, man. It's so close. We are so close. Surprised we can't break that thing down. Or right, whatever. Um Sleep in bed, guard. Guard. Gavinge. Okay. Actually, no no no. Let's guard guard. Let's take her to the to the hospital. Oops. We don't need to take anything. I'm not planning on making any trouble. Oh no, what happened? What? This place got even worse? It wasn't like this last time. Damn. Nothing here. That's not worth it. Why did she bar herself up like that? Listen, I just need a doctor. I need a doctor. We need some damn charity. That's fine. Nothing but useless trash. Really, there's like nothing here now? Oh my gosh. I mean, honestly, anything at this rate, please. Prayer doesn't help. Yeah. Ooh, that guy lost an arm. Ooh, a bandage. Hey, I'm not, I don't plan on making any trouble at all. Okay, run to exit. Don't plan on it. A 
Amelia is back. Please, nobody got into a fight. Please, please. Day 31. Night was calm. Alright, sweet. Gotten bandages. Okay, so she's still slightly wounded and tired. The kid is still depressed. Talk to the kid. He's very hungry. Um, ooh, we just need bait. Damn, really? We don't have any bait? Be able to make one if we had one. I'm gonna try making another trap if I can. I have just enough to make another trap. Okay. Can we do it in the basement? Shoot. I hate it. It's always the right side. Okay, there we go. Have him go rest. Go hang out with uh, Roman. got what's it gonna be uh the vegetables actually some raw yeah and one vegetable what can i give you for this well sir i can give you some snow how about some wood? Nope. Not worth it. Uh, did you take a shovel? How about this? Some herbs. And that. What? Okay, I'll take that. Is somebody very hungry? Hungry, 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 hippo. <laughs> Where's the kid going to? Daddy! It seems like always better off uh, letting them decide what they want to do. Actually, can we make that food now? 
Nice. Awesome. See if the kid will answer the door. Dude, I don't know what to do with this kid. I literally won't stop crying. Actually, I forgot to load this thing up too. just yet. Alright, let's have Roman relax. Let's just end the day. Come on, we've got to almost be there. Sleep with child, sad, tired, hungry, slightly wounded. Um, let's have him guard. I think we can last one more day before, before going out again. We've been raided. All right, they didn't steal anything. Uh, this is why this kid is so sad all the time. Keep getting raided. I could talk to the kid. You're very tired. She's very hungry. But she's still sleeping. Looks like she healed up though. Actually, listen to the radio first. It's getting warmer. <laughs> Later promised their forces are going to put an end to a conflict in a matter of days. Troops have crossed the border are ad ad advancing unopposed towards her and they should reach the city in two or three days. Nice. Let's make some food. He's very hungry. They're talking. Let's make one high on fuel. We were really out of, oh, whoops. I think they're glitched. They're stuck. Oh, nice. We have raw food down here too. All right, you go open that, open or close that door. I don't know what's going on with that. The 
they're stuck. Actually, he's at the door. Got a proposition for you? You're new here, aren't you? It's your proposition. Hi there. You aren't from around here, are you? I've come to tell you that there's an abandoned house nearby. The owners fled the city a long time ago when it was possible. Uh, if you help me get inside, we might find something there of value. What do you say? Give me a sec. Um, who should I have go? Yeah, I guess, I guess she can go. Come to tell you that there's a random house nearby. When I was flooded the city a long time ago, it was when it was still possible. Yeah, sure. They're stuck. They're actually stuck. What do I do? They won't move. All right, let's end the day, I guess. <gasps> the war is over. You survived. What happened to Amelia, though? She left. Uh-oh. Day three. Alone, when burglars came, some people came to hurt me and take over our things, and some things, no one stopped them. Wounded child. The bastard wounded little Iskra, how could they? She's just a child. I remember that, actually. Unexpected gift. Our neighbor brought us supplies of wood to help us last through difficult times. Roman was seeking shelter. Roman was looking for shelter, and we let him stay with us. Yeah, and I'm very glad that we did, even though they did get into some fights. Neighbors in, de in need. Family were neighbors came to ask for help. In reinforcing their shelter, we're happy to help them, saving lives. For medication, we shared the little we had with them. Children we had helped earlier came to ask us for some food we shared with them. Child's despair. It's heartbreaking to watch a child plunge into sorrow. It's an image you can't forget. Cease fire. The long-awaited ceasefire finally came into force, eventually putting an end to the fighting and poor those who managed to survive war would never forget it. Iskra and her mother cried for hours when they were finally reunited. Both of them had horrible memories which they chose not to talk about. Happy Clean was gone, Iskra's eyes for years to come. She became terribly frightened of rats in confined spaces. She could not sleep with the lights out. Even long after the war, she sometimes wake up screaming at night. Roman survived the war. Tortured by his past, he started doing hard drugs and a few years later died of drug-related health problems. When the war ended, Christo managed to reunite with his wife. Luckily, she was unhurt. They resumed work and did not It did their best to alleviate the effects war had on Iskra, as well as ensure she had a normal childhood, perhaps. With a lot of love, care, they would succeed. After the war, Amelia wanted to forget, so she left and went to USA, where she was joined a law firm. She makes good money, her father would be proud. However, she's troubled by working nightmares and has developed hatred towards men. Oh. What? I guess because of Roman. Damn. Well, that's the effects of war, I guess. <coughs> Imagine having to go through all that. So which one did we play? Oh, we did this one. Okay, I see. I see. What's um final cut uh, final cut content? Uh you survive, you'll be put you can be sure you'll be playing the content of Final Cut scenario with new locations, otherwise be included at random. Okay. Cool. This one's the new one. And you start with Marco too. That's cool. Workshop center. 
What? Wait, browse workshop. What kind of workshop stuff do they have? Just curious. John Rambo. Civil War. Huh. Alright. Well, I think that's going to be it for me, pretty much. Uh, replay the ending of your last attempt. Wait, really? What's that do? I'm just curious. Oh, it just replaced the ending. That's all. Shoot. Okay. Huh. Well, this game, I really enjoyed it. Honestly, um, I'm looking forward to playing through these tomorrow. Disable all mods for best experience. So most likely we'll be starting with uh, tomorrow. We'll start with Father's Promise and then see how long that goes and then play the last broadcast and Fading Embers um, on Saturday. Depending on, I might be able to finish it completely. I don't know. And then I might start like one more like this guy. Oh, shoot. 